I remember listening to this song in first grade. <laughs> Okay, we are on our way to chloride. I'm gonna go try to. I didn't even know what a tum was left back then. <laughs> a tum? A tum? Um, we're gonna go check out these things called the painted rocks. Hopefully. I was trying to see, the, like, this is chloride, and on this rock they put a C. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, if so, that would be awesome if you could see it, but hopefully. You can. All right, so we'll be there in a few minutes, probably, hopefully, if we can find it. This oh, is no, the no, sign no, for no, chloride. No, uh, established in 1860. It's got a Baptist, Baptist church, volunteer fire department, chamber of commerce, historical society, a VFW post, and auxiliary, and Silver Bells Playhouse. Woo-woo, that's where we're going. In Town Hall and Payroll Avenue. Oh, that's where it's located? All right, let's go see if we can no, find something interesting. I wanted you guys cemetery. to see this. What is it? A gnome, gnome cemetery? A gnome retirement okay. home. I'm going to go back. Gnome a gnome retirement home. home. Slash scary. mission is behind us. Gnome. And look at this. Oh, you can't see it. The roof is like hay or something. Straw. It is kind of hay. Says so a gnome like uh, retirement home. Like chicken fat. It's probably or super or cool. We should definitely. In honor it. to chloride's miners. Oh. Oh, and homage. In homage. homage to chloride's miners. I just miners. can't read. Yeah, you can't read. All right, let's find. You're getting yours you know, you're cutting my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was not. This is the gnome um, place. Welcome, Mom. Oh, do you see the, the roof? Welcome, Mom. Hi, honey. That said Rose Cottage. I want you to see the, the roof. It, I, yeah, she keeps turning on. All right, bye. You can't go to the left. You can't go to the left. It does not mean you can't trespass on this stroke. Road stroke. Um, we found a sign that says mur murals. Murals? Murals. <laughs> and we also found, oh, that said no camping. Muriel? Um, Muriel? Muriel. And then that over there, uh, I'm trying to go out the window because her window's super dirty, is I'm pretty sure the mine. Drive, Lamar, Jesse. <coughs> Do you see a little bird? I saw a little bird. Why must you mention Merle? Oh, Merle? Do you see that? It looks That's like a mine. mine. If I go down there, I don't know if I'm going to come back. <coughs> you can, Jesse, the road's smooth. Do you want me to drive? Okay, so... So this is what like it like this is just normal when you're in the middle of nowhere to follow this and feel like you're going in the right direction. Yeah, <laughs> this is like the scene in uh, the wrong turn. The road is crap. To get, like, I wish I'd had my truck. Me that. too. But um, I don't, so I'm making my daughter drive down it. You can play it's fine, Dale. What? You're fine. And also um. We just seen two guys with bows and arrows. Like this is hunting season for 15 days. So <laughs> they're hunting right now in this area with bows and arrows. Alrighty, so uh, just just so we're you know just for our own. Come on, drive past this little bush. I mean, we were, we've been driving for we who knows how long in this back wood area, but now we know we're going the right way because look. An arrow. And a peace sign that says not something. <laughs> and a peace sign that says, we're not going to kill you. Keep coming. On the side of a rock. In red. In red. <laughs> Who knows? Hold on. So, two roads. Which way do we go? Mama, road. Mama. I picked the one less traveled mama. by. And that has mama. made all the difference. Mama. <laughs> so, which road? The one to the right. The one less traveled. Where's the other arrow? I don't know. Alright, so I guess we are wrong. Zoom in, what does it say? And there's an arrow. It doesn't say anything. It's an arrow. Is there two arrows though? Looks like no, it's only there's only one arrow, but they try to make it decorative. <coughs> so we have to go back on a different road. Have to do a little U around. There is no U-turns. We have to drive backwards the whole way and then get onto that road. Alright, well. Found some of them. Pretty cool looking. Over here, the sun. I can see. 
so some some guy I'm not sure what his name is decided to just come out here and paint rocks pretty awesome Go closer. I mean some serious detail his footprint right there that's pretty cool Is that super large? Let me see. Oh, that's not his footprint. Well, maybe. Jeez. That's huge. Compared to mine. But, um, he definitely can paint. Look at this, like a little. Oh, this is probably chloride, like with the mining, the mine. You know, chloride way back when. And sun and the moon. Little bear claw. Snake. I also see some of, uh, I don't know what this is. These may be from him or from uh, many years before that. Some kind of a marking. It's pretty awesome. But oh, this is the journey. The journey images from an inward search for self i like it that was his journey he went out here and painted rocks so that he could um you know try to do an inward search for himself for his own meaning of life Purcell, I think, or Purcell. Is that like a fish's tail or mermaid? This is like um, flame, and then it's got the animals. Like so, way back in the day, you know, there's like things called pictographs. So I wonder if it was just people like this who just wanted to leave their mark, you know, on a wall or a building, not expecting it to really last thousands and thousands of years. I hope the sun's not super bright. Yeah. Oh, let me come back over there then. A minute. Hold on. Let me get what's over here while I'm here. Okay. I had to actually climb half the mountain to get where the sun wasn't super bright. Look at this. this oh, it's an Indian lady, I think. First, I thought it was an alien. There's something above that. With the star, see it? And then over here. Let's see if I can show like the full picture. So, so over there we've seen the snake's head. This is snake's body. I wonder if somehow it all. Oh no, it's not. It's look, it's got a claw on it. It's pretty awesome. So he painted in between the cra uh, cracks. It's another lighted thing. 
footprints that go up there all the way up there look to the little symbols of stuff definitely had to be peaceful to be out here I mean right now it's super peaceful and I'm just looking at it but the feeling of painting it creating beauty in a place that's already beautiful it's really good right there look at that some serious details yeah you just have to climb over rocks and okay this is the claw at the bottom of the Woo! I'm standing on a rock on the bottom of the I mean underneath the snake so maybe it's a dragon it's like snake uh, scales and then comes down to a claw in the city that's a city the claw has landed on that is awesome and he just painted this. It's, it's amazing. Oh, look, on the back of that. Oh, let me jump off this rock. Oh. Whoa. It's like a wolf. I think there's a whole bunch more out here, but I'm probably only going to do this one section today because the road beyond this looks way... Um, more shady for my daughter's car. I don't know if it'll make it. And we gotta worry about getting out of here too without getting a flat tire. Because there's no cell service. <laughs> Wait, oh, there's this little small snake. Woo! I mean, it's everywhere you look, you just see more and more and more. Look, a bird. This is like a, just a bird in the sky flying over top of the scene. You mean naked woman up there? Yeah, I see the naked woman. Oh, look, a naked man. Where? On the other side. Oh. Well, I don't know if he's naked. That'd be good. Naked-ish. I know. He's, he just, look, a peace I'm sign. Naked. Or yin and yang, I mean. I want to climb it. Like the different phases of yin and yang? If I climb it, would probably fall. No, but don't say fall when I'm standing underneath all these rocks. Look, there's a snake again. I, I just seen his mouth. Okay, so it's just a different snake. But it's a snake or dragon that has a clawed foot that we found here. Okay, and I want to step back enough to get this other. Oh, shoot, fire. Gosh darn it. I almost, I almost, I almost fell down. Okay. So look how that piece of, okay. In, just by itself, the way the rock is sitting there is amazing. I, I see a lot of stuff. I just don't understand how the rock can still be standing up like that. But then he went up there and painted it. That, that rock is taller than a person. You see that? Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to get that part behind you and then we can go. So this is like the, what would that be? Like a mine shaft? So see how like. the candle's on the inside of it? Uh, chloride is a mining town, so you see the snake right that now? would make sense. Yep. Alrighty. Well, I'd say this man's on a wonderful journey, and we should probably all on our own journey. So now our journey is going to take us to Vegas. Thanks for watching.